Hey guys, I made a Roman map of the world calculator based off of this map, which was made by Roman geographer, geographer Pomponius Mella in 43 CE. Mella is considered to be the first Roman geographer. And this is a statue of Pomponius Mello. And this is his map. And I'm going to, what I did was I used modern populations that I believed were good fits for this map from antiquity based on the Roman view of the world. And then I ran, uh, and this is, I did this with the uh, global 25 data scaled database of modern populations, averages. And then I ran the calculator, so I'll show you my results. Anyway, it's kind of fun, not to be taken too seriously as I always say. But uh, anyway, here's the map. And you can see, um, how the Romans saw Asia here. Um, you can see India up here. Um, you can see Cirrus, which is like northern China. Uh, Scythia, which is Scythia, just sort of uh, like eastern Iranians. Uh, Parthia, um, which is sort of like, uh, I believe, uh, sort of northern Iran, Turkmen uh, parts of Turkmenistan. You have per Perses here, which is uh, Persia, uh, the far Fars region of uh, modern-day Iran. Uh, you have uh, Arya, uh, which is, uh, I believe, western Afghanistan. And uh, you have Arabia here, which is, I guess, in the Roman Arabia would have been like uh, modern-day Jordan, Petra, um, although I use uh, Saudi, the Saudi Arabia as an example. Um, you have Mesopotamia here. And I use the modern Iraqi population for that. You have Syria, the Roman province of Syria, and you have Judea, the Roman provinces, province of Judea. I used uh, Samaritans, which are uh, along with, I would say, Le Lebanese Christians are, and probably uh, Palestinian Christians as well, are the closest populations to modern populations to um, ancient Israelites and Judeans. Um, and then for, and then there's a, uh, into Africa. Oh, you also, in Asia, you also have Asia Minor, uh, which I used, uh, the Greek Central Anatolia, uh, for Asia Minor. You have Sarmatia, which, um, the Sarmatians is, uh, sort of, uh, Eastern European pop, uh, ancient population. And I use Ukraine, modern Ukraine for that. And then you uh, you get see so you get to Africa. You have uh, Ethiopia, which was sort of as the Romans saw it, sort of more I think what I, my research showed more towards Sudan, uh, but also Ethiopia too. So I use an Ethiopian population that was close to the Sudanese. Uh, you have Libya um, and Sarini, which is which is a Roman Greek and Roman city in Libya. So I don't need, I just I just use Libya, a modern Libyan population. You have uh, Numidia, uh, which I think I used Algeria, modern Algerians. Uh, that's Numidia is a, was a were Berber tribes, and Mauritania, which was sort of like uh, the modern country of Mauritania, and also like northern Morocco. And so I use a northern Moroccan population, and then uh, you get into uh, Europa. You have uh, Hispania, which is Iberia, Portugal, and Spain. You have Gall Gallia. Just Latin word for Gaul, which is uh, modern day France and and most of Switzerland and some parts of along the Rhine River in Germany um, and uh, some other areas around there. Uh, I didn't include Belgica or Raetia, it's sort of overlapping. Uh, you have Germania, which I use Germ Germany. You have Britannia, so I use modern England. Um, of course, Italia, so I use Lazio, Lazio which is the region that includes Rome and Sicilia. 
Um, use the East Sicilian and West Sicilian populations for that. Uh, Thule over here on the uh, far left. Thule is like really Nordic, Scandinavian Nordic, so I use Norwegian, uh, Norway. Uh, Dacia is uh, like modern day Romania. Uh, Thracia, um, I used uh, Bulgaria. Uh, Illyria, I used uh, Albania. And Gracia, I uh, used Greek Dodecanese. Um, there are many different Greek populations, but you do get a lot of ver genetic variety amongst the Greek populations. And it seemed to me that the Greek Dodecanese is possibly the closest to uh, the uh, Greek population of the Roman times. Uh, I could be wrong about that, but I went with Greek, Greek Dodecanese. Um, so anyway, there's the map. And I'll show you in, uh, and there's the uh, Roman geographer. And I sh I'll sh just show you in uh, the source. You can see the populations that I used here. You can see Cirrus, Han, Han, Shan, Shan, Han Chi, India, Brahmin, Tamil, Nedu, Arya, Hazaria, uh, Afghanistan, Scythia, Bashkir, Parthia, Iranian, Turkmen, Golistan, Perses. Um, Iranian Fars, Mesopotamia, Iraqi, um, Arabia, Saudi, Judea, Samaritan, Syria, Syrian, Armenia, Armenian, Sarmatia, Sarmatia, Ukrainian, Asia Minor, Greek Central Anatolia, Egyptus, Egyptus, Egyptian, Libya, Libyan, Numidia, Algerian, Mauritania, Moroccan North, Sicilia, Sicilian East and Sicilian West. Italia, Italian Lazio, Hispania, Spanish Castilla y Leon, Gallia, Swiss French, Germania, German, Illyria, Albanian, Gracia, Greek Dodecanese, Thracia, Bulgarian, Dacia, Romanian, Thule, Norwegian, Britannia, English, Ethiopia, Ethiopian, and Nuak. So, and here is my results in the Enmonte Admixture Calculator. So you can see a uh, very pretty good distance there at 1.7556%. 30, 30 sources, eight cycles. And so Judea is my top population there in the admix calculator at 37%, um, followed by Dacia, then Hispania, then Illyria, then Persis, Britannia. Let's go. We can scroll down. You can see up close my results. So Judea, Dudacia, Hispania, Illyria, Perses, Britannia, Numidia, and India, a trace result. And then if you add the, um, the uh, run it with the ADC uh, additional distance column at 0.25% or 25x uh, recalculated, which is supposed to give a tighter fit, I uh, get Sicilia. 42.4, Dacia 32.6, Judea 19.6, Arabia 2.4, Perses 1.8, Mesopotamia 1.2. And for distance, you can see I get uh, Sicilia as my closest population, and then Italia, Illyria, Gracia, Thracia, etc., etc. And you can see that, you know, I'm, uh, my ethnicity is, um, I'm an Eastern Ashkenazi Jew. Uh, my closest modern population is in the modern, global 25 modern average scale. It is usually uh, averages Ashkenazi Ukraine. So you can see that we're, you know, mixed population, a mixed mostly Mediterranean population uh, with the, you know, the, at least for me, you can see the, the Judean there, the original Judean ancestry, and then the diaspora admixture, which, you know, places us pretty close to uh, Mediterranean populations such as Sicilians. So anyway, just wanted to share that. Thanks for, for watching.